Hey guys, back here again. Here we're gonna see what type of groups we can get with this 1875 Remington. We're gonna shoot BBs through it, then hollow point pellets and wad color pellets. We're gonna see what gets the best groups on this. So, let's see what we can do with this thing. Okay, so this is what we're gonna be running through the 1875 Remington. We got these Air Venturi still BBs that are like anti-rust coating. We got the Umarex still BBs. We're gonna try those. In here, I just got a tin full of Daisy BBs. We have hollow points. This right here is the uh, flat nose, so those ain't the hollow points. These right here are the hollow points. We got them loaded up in the cartridge. And then we got the Hornady uh, Black Diamond BBs when we shoot through there, so we'll see what we can do with all these. Target. Alright, he's be shooting at the right target. He's using the hollow points 7.9 grain. Wow, it's got some zip to it. He's bag rests in it. Wow, that thing really hits with some authority. I think one for still, safety. Yeah, one for safety, always with the wheel gun. That's, that's not too bad for for hollow points. Got one down there in the black and one over there, so we're gonna try uh try BBs next. Alright, we're shooting at the left target, horny black diamond BBs. See what type of groupings we can get with it. To be your last shot. Mm -hmm. This be shot number six. All right, let's see what type of groupings we got. Okay, this is a grouping we got with the the, the black diamonds. So there's one, two, three, four, five, and six up here. But there's four right in there. So not too bad. We're going to be using these to paste over our shots, so we don't have to mark them with this pen. Because we took these and these, that's the horny black diamonds, and these are the hollow points. The next shots we're going to put through them, it's going to be wad cutters, and then we'll run some daisy BBs through it. Alright, now we're running wad cutters through it. Shooting on the, on the left target, right? Mm-hmm. Pretty sure that was six, but I'd six. do one more. One for safety. Uh, I like those wad cutters, see? They were all right in there. And I was holding center on the on the target, so they were really, really close. Wad cutters for for pellets through them. Pretty cool. Alright, now we're shooting the daisy BBs. We'll be shooting at the right target. See type of groovy and we get the daisy BBs. So far, the wad cutters are doing the best. Wad cutters did awesome. That was sick. Let's do another one for safety. 
Okay, daisy babies are all up in this area here. One, two, three, four, five, and six. So there, for a pistol smooth bore, not too bad. All right, guys, last two we got is the Air Venturi Still BBs with anti rust coated. And we got these uh, Umarex Still BBs. So we got to open these up. That hasn't been opened yet, but yeah, you know, it's got kind of funnel, which is nice. But uh, run these two together and see what we can do. Right now, we're going to be using the Air Venturi anti rust coated BBs. Shooting at the left target. Thing's still got some zip. <laughs> still a good amount of shots there, and it's still still shooting pretty dang hard. Six. One for safety. Yeah, the air venture is not too bad. I was aiming here. One, two, three, four, five, and six. So not too bad for for BBs. All right, now we're shooting the final. This is the uh, Umarex Still BBs. Let's see what type of groupings we can get with this. Okay, these are the shot group with the Umarex in there. Right in, one there, four, five, and six, so not too bad for BB2. Comes a little monster, guys. Had to come over for the video, ain't that right, little monster? Yeah, little monster cat, official mascot, back here on our channel. Got a little monster. The best cat in the world. Yes, you are. All right, guys, we're going to be shooting at the shoot and see with the wide cutters. So what we got the best shots with. We put a lot of rounds through this, so the CO2 might be getting a little weak, but we'll see what we can do. Oh, well, dead center. Yeah, I think so. Safety. All right, this was our second round with the with the wide cutters. Yeah, not too bad for a smooth bore pistol, but not too bad. All right, guys, I'm gonna see what I can do with the wide cutters. I don't see what we did. All right, guys. I know one shot I put down here. The rest of my shots kind of grouped all around there. So, really, really like that with squad cutters. Really impressed with the wad cutters through that gun. Okay, we shot a few more with the BBs again. We didn't film the shooting, but this is the Air Venturis we got. You know, I took four here, one there, and then one there. These are the Umarexes right here. One there, one there, one there, one there, one there, and I think one might have went off target. So if I had to choose a BB, I would probably go with the Air Venturis through these. They seem a little bit more accurate to me. And if you're going to go for a pellet, definitely go with the wad cutters. Those things are awesome through this. Hey guys, 
What do you think shot the best out of this? I think the wad cutters and the Air Venturi BBs did the best. The wad cutters were from Crossman and the Air Venturi BBs, of course, for Air Venturi. I think they did the best. So what do you guys think? Leave a comment below and you know, hopefully the next video I'll get is a cowboy rifle for Boomer X. So catch you guys on the next one.